hello and welcome hello and welcome hello everyone also i would just like to point out i'm really sorry if my makeup actually offends anyone because it is hideous i've literally been working all day too cute after that I, but anyways let's get into it so first of all we'll start with the clothes what these way like fake like pleather jeans is that what you call them i don't know they're like wee leather jeans i just call them all the clothes i bought were from boohoo i have a pair of these but they're like lace up at the front here and but they're kind of busted i've had them for like a year but i literally wear them all the time i think these are so good it's a bit more dressy than normal jeans but yeah they were literally like 20 pound or something i don't have the wee receipt so i don't know how much they were but i don't think anyone's asking anyways i bought this little top it's now week 14 of quarantine it's now week 14 of quarantine it's like when it's on it has like these little funky shoulders and it's kind of cute a shoulder and i love animal print it's a problem which we will get to later on but yeah that's that it's just a mesh top the last thing i bought for clothes was this dress which is also animal print and it is slightly hideous <laughs> no 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 <laughs> hear me out with a tan and you know for like chilling in the house like you're not really going anywhere bro bro it was like four pound or something i thought it was going to be like a way cute mesh summertime dress you know you're going out shopping at one and you're going for a pint at four it's not really giving me those vibes maybe with a wee belt or something it could be it could be a vibe that's that i got a new pair of air forces as well i've already worn these that's why they're slightly dirty so I've got a few other things and then the majority of this video is going to be beauty stuff. I wear contacts. I phoned my optician literally the day they were closing and the girl was like, I can send you monthlies. And I'm like, I don't want monthlies, but she's like, you're just going to have to make do. But I already had solutions and stuff, so it wasn't that big of a deal and I used to wear them. So she had to send me them, but then I realised I had no cases, so I had to order some online. Ordered these wee cases. Got mine in the pink one now and I've got a spare one as well really boring opened this by the way because i didn't do like a wee glow up video didn't do it i got a wee eyebrow dying kit please excuse my nails gorgeous i know i got the dark brown shade next thing i bought like i've literally bought the most random stuff this phone case um i also bought a white one which is on my phone right now but it is it took so long to come as well i bought that from amazon i think both of them together were like eight pounds so bargain.com so, <laughs> i'm not dramatic at all i also bought this it's like reckless journal um just something to do if i'm bored it's kind of something like p7s would do like you know quarantine just entertainment like it and do random stuff so this is what this page says random but anyways and i also got um oh, there's more stuff i got this burn after writing this is just you know something to get deep and personal you know three restart those vibes and um, i've literally filled in like three pages then i also got some screen protectors because mine broke i also bought a new electric blanket it's from silent night it's for double bed fun facts no one cares i don't need to get one off my bed yet it's still in the box it's been in the box for about a week and a half so that literally sums up how much patience I have. I changed my bed yesterday. Why didn't I take it off? We're moving on to booty. Start with tan. I bought this because I was like, there's no tan. I need tan. Me is going into lockdown for the foreseeable future. Doesn't need any tan. Ordered more tan anyways. I bought white to brown tan in the shade dark. And Move on to our second bottle of tan. This is the ultra dark because the dark was run out and I'd rather be ultra dark than medium. The dark was nothing on the website. Um, this was also reduced to a tenner so I was like, can't knock a tan for a tenner. It's been at least four weeks since I've put tan on and I've bought three bottles of tan. Plus the bottles like I already had open that I just haven't finished yet. I'm just trying to, like, I hope someone can relate because this is an issue what the golden are glow i love um like lotion tan is that what you call it like that's what that white department is it's on my sister like lotion i always used to use some ritz because it was cheap and convenient but it reacted really badly with my skin because i've got really sensitive skin so 
we threw that in the bin and then we saw it right to brown and it's actually been decent on my skin so i'm hoping these will still be fine this is mango scented i don't know if that's going to be an issue but whatever and this one is tropical scented so now we're moving on to her first of all i bought a her mask but it's just her essence one and the matching spray for your hair like a wee hydrating spray and this one is also a hydrating mask your hair can never be too hydrated unless it's with grease that's disgusting i used to use this one i always get the wee monthly subscription to birchbox so i actually have a full one here that got delivered today so I always use birch box so this came in one of my birch boxes and it's this i've literally never seen it in a shop but i looked on the website to buy it and it was sold out by the way and it's i'm really like this just bits from my hair yeah there's literally nothing in it but i kept the bottle in case i see it and i'll know what it is I used this a few times and i used the hair mask once i believe so yeah rate it smells so good especially the hair mask smells unreal so i bought this today actually because i was in work today and i really need a hair brush as this is the current situation my hair brush is in two bits i have literally three of these hair brushes do you ever brush your hair and you literally look at yourself and be like i look like a clur like say a few years ago like i was literally like second year or something I call my mates like we had our hair like really slicked back and looked really stinking like a bunch of eggs and we were all like oh my god we look like clairs like I don't know where it came from it's just it's a Karen like it's the equivalent of Karen like he's he's not a talk away you don't this is the current situation of my hairbrush I really wanted a wet hairbrush and I was going to order one online but I was like surely Superdrug will have one. So then I called in Superdrug today because it's literally facing my work and I was sitting there looking at the selection of hairbrushes. This was me. Absolutely not one singular wet hairbrush in sight. Bear in mind like I recall seeing this brand of hairbrushes all the time. I was sitting there and I was like where is the one hairbrushes? I'm just going to have to order one off Amazon. So I lifted another one because I need a hairbrush. I even lifted one and I looked up this is what i saw this is what i saw this is facing me this hairbrush and i was like i was loving it then i looked closer <whistles> why is it green we all love a cheetah print in this house what is that do you know what i bought it that's how much i needed a hairbrush i bought the hairbrush and i'm not even going to talk about it anymore because listen it was worth it i hope it was worth it i'm going to use it and see if it's not i'm um, actually i'm writing a complaint i'm writing to the ceo of wet hairbrushes and saying why did this break this is my fourth hairbrush that has broken it is not me it is you even though the other hairbrushes aren't from that company but anyways it is you that's what i have to say Okay, anyways, I'm just going to move on. I bought a nail polish, so I don't even, I'm not going to be like moving on to nail polish. I bought one nail polish. I bought this wee bar one because I've been painting my nails recently. Don't know why every item needs an explanation. Moving on to our final portion of the video. I also bought this. I used the face wash of this and it was really good. So I bought this. Um, I needed a new toner. I used this toner. Um, again, got it in. Um, I really like this spray but I couldn't get another spray one in Superdrug so I just bought this in Superdrug while I was there and I'm going to probably pour it in here so I can spray it. I got me and my mum also both bought stuff and I got free micellar water. I try not to use this because it's apparently weird for your pH of your skin but um, for like travel and stuff they're really cute. I also got Barry M concealer. I use this all the time. I needed it for my makeup. Then I'm tan. I use shade three. I have it here. It's called Cookie. And when I'm pale as I am now, I use milk shade one. It's really good. Um, really affordable. It's for forty nine, I think. And I use that all the time. It's my favorite concealer. And then I also bought the Tree Match because I had literally no uh, pale foundation. Go to events and stuff in March, and I was like, oh, I don't need pale foundation. I'll be tan all the time and I have like all this abundance of tan makeup which I can't use so I bought my L'Oreal tree match in rose ivory and finally finally I bought a little face mask 
Uh, it's from Garnier. But you know I love her skin girl. And it's the Moisture Bomb for Nighttime Face Tissue Mask. These all probably know and love these. Yeah, these are really good. I also, in one of my birthday boxes, just, I got this. It's like, you know, one of the things you like roll on your face and they're always cold, like always cold. It's like good for your circulation and stuff in your face. It's meant to be really good for sheet masks. They wanted a sheet mask, so I could use that because I haven't used it yet. And it has hyaluronic acid in it, which is always the bonus. So yeah, that is essentially everything I've bought during quarantine. Thanks for watching. Bye.